time on the blog, we're talking about 4K Ultra HD peripherals, specifically this, the Samsung UBD K8500 Blu-ray player. It's a 4K ready Blu-ray disc player that you'll need if you have a 4K TV and vice versa. You'll need both the TV and the Blu-ray player to enjoy 4K content like 4K movies. 4K, of course, is ultra high definition. It's got millions more pixels than the next best TV, which is 1080p. Uh, and the 4K and the UHD Ultra HD names are kind of all interchangeable. The 4K stands for about 4,000, and that's the number of horizontal pixels there are across the screen in a 4K TV. In addition to a 4K content player and a 4K TV, you also need special 4K content. If you don't have all three of those things combined, you're just not going to be able to get the most out of your 4K items. Fortunately, identifying that 4K content is easy. Just look for the symbol on the discs. Of course, the other way to get 4K content is to use the smart capabilities of the Samsung Ultra HD Blu-ray player itself. It's got several smart functions built right in. You can use a USB stick or similar to get other types of media onto the Blu-ray player and see them on your TV. You can also use the Samsung App Store. So it's got a number of different built-in streaming channels. It's essentially got all the functions of a smart uh, streaming device built right into the player. So whether that's Netflix or YouTube or any number of other smart streaming channels, you can use them right from the Blu-ray player itself. It means you don't need another external streaming device. The Samsung UBD K8500 Blu-ray player also has a web browser built right in, but I'm not even going to exaggerate about this one. It is a disaster to use. You've got to use the tiny little cursor function on the remote to get the cursor moving in order to even just input a web page. And then you've got to peck it out basically key by key using that same cursor control. It takes forever to put in even one single page. So while having a web browser built into your device is kind of a good idea. In this case, it doesn't function very well at all. Whether you're watching a Blu-ray disc in 4K or you've downloaded some 4K content from a portal like YouTube, the quality is amazing. The color is really vivid. The lines are super sharp and even in action scenes, there's no motion blur. While it's really hard to replicate 4K video using an HD setup here on my camera, you'll just have to take my word for it that 4K Ultra HD TV technology is a lot sharper and a lot more interesting to watch than regular 1080p. Overall, I was really happy with this Blu-ray player. It worked really well with the Insignia Roku TV that I tried it with. And of course, the 4K video quality is just great. So just remember that if you're going to try to enjoy 4K content, you've got to have not only the TV, the Blu-ray player, but the specific 4K content. Thanks again for watching my video. If you like it, I hope you'll like it on YouTube and consider subscribing as well. If you have questions, you can always reach me on Twitter or Instagram at ErinLYYC. Don't forget to read the full version of this review on the Best Buy plugin blog as well.